Today we're going to be talking about picking up sticks and getting stoned to death. Hey, what's up? I'm Josiah Douglas. I do biblical inspiration and motivation here on YouTube five days a week. If that's the kind of thing that you're into. You can go ahead and hit subscribe and we can do this every day together. Today I want to talk to you guys about a story found in Numbers 15. Here it says, While the people of Israel were in the wilderness, they found a man gathering sticks on the Sabbath day. And those who found him gathering sticks brought him to Moses and Aaron and to all the congregation. They put him in custody because it had not been made clear what should be done to him. And the Lord said to Moses, The man shall be put to death. All the congregation shall stone him with stones outside the camp. And all the congregation brought him outside the camp and stoned him to death with stones, as the Lord commanded Moses. Seems a little bit harsh, right? Like, this guy was not doing anything that bad. It was just happened to be the Sabbath day and he was gathering sticks, probably for his fire so that he could cook some manna and, you know, not starve to death that day. But for some reason, when they found him, well, they knew that that was against the rules, but they didn't know what to do. And for some reason, when they found him and they asked God what to do, he said, kill him. Which, if you ask me, honestly sounds like a little bit of overkill, right? Right? Right. And obviously, that's not what God thought. I mean, it really sucks for that guy who got stoned to death because he was gathering sticks. But for everybody else, they understood that you don't break God's law. Even the minor things like gathering sticks and doing no work on the Sabbath day. I think the way that God was treating the Israelites is a lot like how you should probably be raising your kids. I know it's kind of like how I raise my kids. If my kids say a bad word, even though it's not really a bad word, you know, that bad of a word, I, uh, I discipline them for it. I want to make sure that they have an example to say, I don't say bad words ever, even though the word they said isn't really all that bad. I mean, it's not like the, you know, the big one. The F word. It's still something they get disciplined for because I don't want them saying any bad words at all and I don't want them to start saying not that bad words now and start saying really bad words later. The F word. Yes, this story shows that God was more harsh with his discipline earlier on in Israel's existence than he was later on when they had kind of grown up a little bit more. But I think it also goes to show that God is really serious about the rules that he gives us. Whether that be the Sabbath day, whether that be honoring your mother and father, whether that be any of the Ten Commandments, or loving your neighbor as yourself, or honoring the Lord your God with all your heart, mind, soul, and strength, God takes them all pretty seriously. So even though you and I probably don't need to worry about being stoned or being put to death because we're gathering sticks on the wrong day, we do need to understand that every single one of God's laws, even the minor ones, He takes seriously. You may not be punished for breaking those laws here on earth, but you will be punished eternally. Or Jesus will be punished, but we don't need to get into the gospel right now. Maybe we do? No, no, not right now. That's a different video. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you like this video, hit the like button. Leave me a comment below about what you think about gathering sticks on the Sabbath. And uh, go ahead and uh, hit subscribe if you haven't. And you know, if you got a little bit extra time, why don't you go and watch this video right here? I think you're going to like it. Thanks, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. The F word.